Ira Booth. Finally, we get to meet him right here in Matra. And uh, welcome to Oman. Of course, this has been such a wonderful journey. Uh, yes, thank you uh, for everything. And uh, it was really nice working with you during my walk through Oman. And uh, it's a beautiful day and uh, it's a beautiful city. And uh, how many kilometers have you covered so far from Austria? Oh, uh, around 7,050 kilometers. 7,050 kilometers so far and it's chosen to walk. And there is a very spe special reason for that. Can you tell us? Yes, of course. Um, it started two years ago. My sister gave me a call and she told me she has breast cancer. And uh, I was looking for putting her mind out of her illness, out of her thinking about that. So uh, I decided to walk uh, in Europe. There's a way it's called the St. James Way. And uh, it's written in books, it's shown in books. It's very good. And so I bought one for me, one for her. And I told her she has to follow me on it. So I started walking and she was following me day by day and she wa we were of course in, in, in contact so with, with phone and with WhatsApps and all those things and um, sometimes I didn't answer. So she was worrying about her brother and not anymore about herself and uh, the problem was I had pain and it was so heavy that I was looking at the sky and say God if you keep her safe if you keep me if you bring me safe to Santiago de Compostela I will walk to Mecca so my sister is alive I arrived safe to Santiago and now I have a promise to keep this is the reason why I'm here now I started on the 25th of July last year 2014 and after seven and a half months, I arrived to Muscat. I visited already 12 countries. Oman is number 12. And it's fine to be here in Oman. Great. And um, 7,050 kilometers and few more kilometers to keep the promise. He's reached Oman. And now you will choose to walk with the sea to reach Salala. That's right. Because it's not possible to walk in Saudi Arabia. So uh, I decided to walk the kilometers which I have to do in Saudi Arabia, in Oman. This is the reason why I'm in Oman. And uh, I have, I think, something around 1,600 kilometers more to Salala Seaside. And then fly to Jeddah. And then fly to Jeddah. Now, this must have been a tremendous experience for you. What would you like to share to the world, to all of us? If you walk, you change your mind people are nice uh, what you see in TV is uh, just a show <laughs> and uh, walk and uh, see the people and and talk to the people and you will see the world is good and uh, you know since seven months I'm walking and uh, I don't talk the language of those countries where I walked in I mean ten of them uh, I was safe and everybody was carrying me just like a son, a brother, uh, whatever. Uh, and walking make you healthy again. So I had problems with my discs. I'm carrying now 18 kilograms on my shoulder and I'm walking and I feel just like 30. That's amazing. Yes. And your experience in Amman? Oh, fantastic people. I thought in, when, when I was in Iran, you know, the people was carrying me just like very tight. It was very nice to be in Iran. In Oman, I get the same with two kisses, one left, one right. Yes. And this is amazing. So you must have made lots and lots of friends going through these 12 countries. Yes. Uh, I don't remember everybody and I'm so sorry for that. I'm meeting every day minimum 10 people. So I can't remember everybody, but it is wonderful. And of course, you can follow Tyra Mood uh, Abud on uh, the Facebook and, and on my blog. And your blog. My blog is www.ontheway.today. Uh, you find me on Facebook under my name Abud Thaer. I spell it A B U D and T H A I R. And of course, on omanobserver.com. I'm Lakshmi Kathner, thanking you for joining us. Thank you so much. Thank